Hi Sunshines, welcome back to our channel Mad Curls. I'm Taylor Ann. And I'm Lorianne. And welcome to another Mad Curls video. Today we are doing another review and wash and go for you guys. Ma, tell them what products in the line that is up today. Today we're doing the new line by Talia Wahid called Apple and Aloe with Coconut. Ooh, it's yeah. green apple. Oh, green apple. Right, that's right. Okay. So it comes with, um, it has three products in the collection. And it's the green apple and aloe with coconut shampoo. There, it's a true shampoo. There is the green apple and aloe uh, leave-in conditioner. Mm -hmm. And the curl definer. Yeah. That's what comprises this line, <laughs> this collection. So we'll start talking about the shampoo since we're here. Mm -hmm. uh, Mom, go ahead. I love shampoo, so I love this. I love the smell. The smell is very intoxicating. It smells just like a green apple. Yeah, oh the God, smell of these so products pleasant. are really good. Yeah. It smells really good. I really like the way it smells. I love the, the color. I love the pearlescent. Look, it's a true shampoo. I think it's very moisturizing. I use this to detangle my hair, believe it or not, because, you know, you guys have been following us for a while now, and I had problems in the beginning with detangling and the fairy knots and all that so then you kind of bullied me and told me to start detangling my hair in the shower so with conditioner with conditioner but I did and I started with shampoo and I just stuck with shampoo I don't know something about the crunchiness of the shampoo and me pulling my hands through but what I like about this is it's very sudsy and I've been what I've been doing to wash my hair is dividing my hair into four so I'll go down the middle and then part it here and then kind of clip two here clip two here and then take individual pieces and put a little bit of shampoo in and just kind of shampoo that clip it back up take this piece down shampoo that clip it back up and then when it's all shampooed then take them all down and just kind of rinse I don't know it's just my little thing I've been doing lately but I like this shampoo you are a fan me on the other hand um I'm a co-wash person. I really love co-washes, but um, I do have a favorite shampoo and conditioner that I use, so I'm always like open to trying a new shampoo. Um, this is just a shampoo. They have a leave-in conditioner, but I don't shampoo and then put the leave-in conditioner in de to detangle my hair because I feel like I would just go through all of this in the shower like detangling my hair with it. So I do use the shampoo and then go in with another conditioner. I go in with my Aussie Moist to detangle my hair. Um, this is, uh, shampoos can be fun, like I put it in, I like all the lather and it feels good. There's a lot of like slip kind of when you, like you put it in your hair but I don't detangle with this. Um, it's just the part with shampoos when you rinse it out. My hair just felt very, very thick um, and it was tangled because it was already tangled. So I don't, when my hair is tangled and I put shampoo in and then it just feels like dry and now tangled. I guess it's clean and tangled so I don't know but um I probably won't be reaching for this that often just because I'm not a shampoo person but it does smell good it kind of feels it's fun in the hair you know yeah. when you put it in but I'm just not a shampoo gal but you love it I'll probably give it I to you I love it yeah <laughs> oh okay you want to hand over now Make Thank up. you. <laughs> Presents. <laughs> no, I love it, and um, so I, I always reach for it. Yeah, so we did both put that in our hair mm -hmm. today. So the stylers that we are going to style our hair with today are the leave-in conditioner. I love the leave-in. I normally don't like lightweight, watery leave-ins like this, but I love this. I definitely do rinse the shampoo out. you're going through it. Yeah, I am. And then <laughs> go in, again, with the four sections and spray each section um, and I like it and I'm surprised because it is looser than I normally like and I didn't trust it at first but I love it. I feel it has slip and I feel it does yeah. the job. The leave-in's good. It's a leave-in. Yeah. So, so we're going to use the leave-in and we're going to use the curl definer which you really mastered the technique of how we're going to do this. We're going to mm -hmm. show you how to use this because this is extremely thick and when we yeah. say thick it's like thick. It's very thick. It's very, it's very, very it's ex I'm going to insert a clip so you guys can see like me mm -hmm. like putting my finger in it. It's very thick. Um, my handprint is still in it from the last time I used it. The product didn't settle back down. Um, yeah. It's, it's pretty thick, but we figured out a way to use it because sometimes you got to work with these products a little bit. Um, not we. You did. You yeah. figured it out, and then I tried it, and it worked for I me. I love it so. so much. I love the way it smells so much. I was determined to make this product work, um, and I hadn't seen a lot of talk about it. I hadn't seen a lot of people, but I just love the way it smelled. So I'm like, this is in the house and I'm going to make this yeah. work. And you did that so, thing. And I did. You I said really you were going to do Yeah. All right. So if you would like to see Mac Curls rock these products, work them out, then please keep watching. Please keep watching. <laughs> so first things first, water. water. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. It is snowing here. I'm freezing. It is snowing. I kept our portable heater on in my room to like make sure our room was really warm and like the second I turned it off like the room just got cold again even though the heat's on in the house like it's just cold I'm just cold it's just weird what I wasn't yeah. expecting that even though 
I saw that it's going to get worse tomorrow. Yeah, I saw that before when you were when you were telling when you sent me on an errand and you told me to come right back. And 20 minutes later, I wasn't back. You came in the yeah, room. Yeah. So um, <laughs> what was I getting ready to say? You're like, where are like, you? Just, yeah. <laughs> like, I'm like, I'm coming. Oh yeah, because I was telling my mom like my stomach keeps growling, and I wonder if you guys are gonna be able to hear it because like I'm so hungry. I ate this morning, and then it takes us at least like three or four hours to get on camera. I don't know why. I don't know why, but, um, and so I'm like, I'm hungry again, and, um, I was sitting in here waiting for her, and, like, 20 minutes went by, she said she was just gonna go put her shirts on, and I'm, like, waiting, 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 and then I go into her room, and she's sitting on Facebook, <laughs> I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> Let's go! I had a wonderful happy birthday, like, you know how you just kind of, like, look something real quick, and I'm like, oh my goodness, all these birthdays, if I don't do it now, I'll forget. I'm like, Let's so, go. I can't help but that I'm a nice friend. I know you will. <laughs> start laughing now she always laughs when we do the playback and she's water on my shirt there's a whole bunch why my hair is getting long wow. like i don't know i don't understand that at all i just okay. don't so i'm we are going to i said we <laughs> i'm but you're doing it too mm -hmm. section our hair mm -hmm. for this because you really don't want to work in like giant sections because no. you want these products to get in there okay so we are going to put the, the leave, leave in, in. I am really not a huge fan of um, spray leave-ins just because like I have too much hair and I feel like it takes me forever to get like the product in there so for this uh, spray leave-in I actually spray it in my hand and it does have substance it's really not that watery so I like that about the leave-in I just love the way it smells oh my gosh <laughs> Love that. And you'll be spraying it in your hand too because there is coconut in it and I don't want oil on the I backdrop. Know, I know. I've already <laughs> you spray an like willy nilly all over the place. Mm -hmm. So you will be spraying it in your hands as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And it's, you know, even though it's lightweight, spraying it in my hand, it's working for me. All right. It really is. Actually, it's making me save more. Me just kind of spraying it directly on my it's kind head of, is making oops, me I just close it. it. <laughs> Whoa. It smells so good. And you will see it like beat up in your hand. So it's there. Rub, rub, rub. Smooth it in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it smells like a straight up green apple. It does. It smells so good. I know. Which as far as eating goes, green apples aren't really my favorite. Even though they do use to chop them up and put them in Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Those are the ones that you make granny. apple pies with, right? Are they? I think they are. The Granny Smith? Um, are green apples called green, Granny green apples? Smith? Yeah, you kept calling them Macintosh. I'm like, Mother, not Macintosh. Oh, yeah. Well. You know I'm the apple expert. Mm -hmm. I've loved apples since I was a baby. Oh, my gosh. Apples. I call myself making an apple pie. You know how you do anything when you try to get a man? And so <laughs> years ago, I found out that my husband loved apple pies. His mother really knew how to make apple pies, he said. So there I go to the store. I was like, what, 22 or something. Swore I was making an apple pie. Never made one before in my life. And got apples. Didn't know you have to like kind of cook them on the stove first, get them soft, then kind of pour them in, and like have all that like the syrup and the butter and all that and cinnamon. Nope, just took the apples, <laughs> had the crust, cut them up, threw them over in the in the pie shell, and maybe threw in a slab of butter. I have no idea. Put it in the oven. Oh my gosh, it looked like an apple pie when it came out, but it sure didn't taste like one. Was it like crunchy? It was like I don't know what it was. I just I don't I just remember it wasn't the apple it looked like an apple pie but it certainly didn't taste like what you could feel the differentiations of textures. You mm -hmm. could feel the, the the crust. You could see the apples dangling around, dancing around in there because nothing was holding it together. No juices, nothing. Poor little thing. <laughs> Comment pie. down below your favorite pie. I love <laughs> apple pie. I love apple pie, especially the one that's like the is it the Dutch one? I think one with like the crust on it. They like the crumbs on it. Oh, the, the Dutch, Dutch apple pie. The Dutch apple yes. pie is yes. my favorite. But he did say he loved it. It was the best thing he ever had. <laughs> <laughs> Other than his mother's. <laughs> <laughs> so the leave-in is going in. Very, uh, My hair is very shiny. It does have great slip. When you put it in, it's very nice. Yes. So I, I think I'm face. going to work um, with my bottom sections I'm gonna go in with the the curl definer right now but since it's your discovery do you want to explain what I'm getting ready to do yes okay so what we did I, we tried it 
we're liking this idea of um, we love the one and dones because it really speaks to our audience. You guys love one and dones, but we like the fact that we've been kind of testing, taking days to test these products. So one day I used it and I liked the results, but I felt like they could be better. And so in my mind, I thought somehow this has got to be thinned out and it's okay to thin it out. I didn't give myself the liberty before in the past with other products. I just took them as they were. But with this product, I liked it so much. I love the way it smelled. So what I did was I just kind of took a little bit of it and put it in my hand. You can't soak and wet your hair and thinking that you're going to dilute it. You have to dilute this, but it has to be diluted in your hand, yeah. not your hair. With water. So with we, water. we both have bowls of water here just because we're not in the bathroom. Like when we do it in the bathroom, we take a scoop and then yeah. we run our hands under the faucet and really like thin yeah. it out in our hands and then we go in with it. But we both have bowls of water here. And so we're going to put the product in our hands, stick our hand in the water yeah. and like thin it out. So you just kind of want Other than that, it's like this. really thick. Yeah, I mean, you have to really kind of work that water. Real, yeah, you can't through. just take your hand and like dip it in water. Mm -hmm. Like you've got to move your hand around. Yeah. Um, you've got to make it almost like a brand if you new don't If you don't want it that thick, you can right. control how thick you want it. So that's what's going down right now. Mm -hmm. Oops, I forgot to pin this side up. So... That's kind so of that's kind how of how it worked, and I couldn't believe the result afterward. The first day, it's a good brand, it's a good product, mm -hmm. so it looked good, but I felt like it could look better. I felt like it was just a lot of product, a lot of waste. I didn't need all of that, and so the second day, I mastered how to apply this product, and that was the trick. And so then we started rethinking a lot of these products that we've been doing, some of them that can really be thinned down now. Um, I'm thinking maybe cream of nature. Some of the I know we first got the idea from the cream of nature snot. snot. Yep, style and someone snot. said, <laughs> did she say snot the other day in our comments? I'm yeah. like, yep. I didn't make up the name. Cream of nature made it up. Um, but yeah, the snot. You tried it first, straight from the and it flaked tube. and it did everything. And mm -hmm. somebody was like, try using water, thin it out, and that was like the best advice ever. And then you took that and used it for this, and it totally changed um, the results. Yeah. So much better like natural hair is yours you own it you can do whatever you want there are no rules mm -hmm. make the products work for you make your hair work for you it's okay to do things over again you make a mistake and you know it's just kind of like learning your hair yeah so I like finding new discoveries. but again like you said you can't like have like saturated hair and no. think you're thinning the product out you got to work it thin it in your hands first yes. so then it goes through so again you take some put it in your hands and then add that water and just kind of start diluting it in your hand not diluting your not soaking wet your hair and then taking that thick product because it's not gonna pull through right you've got to do this in your hand to make it almost transparent and this is what we found works for us now if you like thick products and you like a lot of moisture yeah then cater it to what you like. I mean, mm -hmm. you may not need to dilute it at all, maybe just a little bit. Yeah. Maybe not like the way we're just dropping drops and huge drops of water. Maybe that's diluting it too much. Yeah, we have 3B, 3C hair. Um, if you're like type 4, like deep into the type 4, like you might want all of this um, thickness and moisture. So, um, you know, that's just for our hair, us being 3s, using this product that's very thick. Um, that's how we made it work for us. We thin it out with some water. And I guess you could if you wanted to thin it out maybe with the leave-in but I still think yeah. the leave-in has product in it that's mm -hmm. going to kind of still change the consistency I think the water is the trick for us yeah so good job mama see what testing days do <laughs> you try it didn't work and then she figured out something I else. know yesterday was a fail test day we were on oh my god we were on <laughs> Um, Instagram live last night because it had to be seen to believe if anyone was on Instagram live last night to see that fail that I did um, comment I was there <laughs> it had to be there only those special people that were up at 3 a.m. 3 o'clock in the morning because I was so bothered <laughs> by it but I was so excited I think we went on Instagram live the other day when the products first came in the house and I had been dying to get the leave-in collection from Camille Rose so there I was in Target, walking down the aisles, and it was there. I could not believe it. I have been trying to get those three products from Camille Rose's website for literally months, and they were always sold out. And there I am in just our local Target, and there they were. They were $13 each. I think you can get them three for 30 um, on the Camille Rose site. So When they're I, there. When they're there. <laughs> and 
I bought all three and I really didn't know how to use them, didn't watch any tutorials. So yesterday we had a problem with the water in the house. We were going to do this video yesterday, but we didn't. So I wet my hair, washed my hair with the shampoo, and now I didn't kind of like really want to waste products. And then you were like, why don't we make this a testing day, test a product? So I was like, I don't really want to. I'm like, you know what? Maybe I'll test that Camille Rose. And I just grabbed the second one. There's one called a Hydrate. There's one called um, Define. Define with, they, one hydrates, one defines, and one is the oil. And I took the latte one, which was the white one, and put it in my hair because it said define. And I didn't have any product to kind of define my curls or anything. And the moment I put it in, you were like, what did you put in your yeah, hair? We like, already knew that? there was an issue, there was a problem. And it only got worse. Then I slapped some of that oil in in the end. It was an absolute disaster. Yeah. If you guys go to our Mad Curls page, do you have a picture on the page? It's only going to be there for 24 hours. Probably by the oh. time they see this, it won't, <laughs> won't be there. Oh, okay. But, yeah. It was a sight to be held. Yeah, no, it was pretty bad. Yeah. It, there was no, absolutely no definition, but I'm not giving up on it. That was the first try. And that's what the point I'm making here. This is what, what the story is about, that you have to try these products. They're way too expensive to buy them and say, this doesn't work and kick them to the curb. I'm determined. I wanted them so bad for so long, and the packaging is so cute, and I love everything Camille Rose. I use, as everyone knows, the bath products, all the shampoos. I have all the butters. I have everything Camille Rose has ever made. I have a clarifying shampoo, all the conditioners, the Janssen's, the Soylicious, the deep conditioner. I'm just a Camille Rose junkie. So these I was determined to have. Finally got them, but I did not know how to use them, so I'm still trying how to use these and make them work for me. So bringing it back to Talia Wahid, which is why we're all here. <laughs> um, so most of my product is in now. I'm just like kind of like fixing different parts, but my hair feels really good. It doesn't feel heavy. Yes. Oh my God. At all. So it's so moisturized. I'm at the stage now where like my bangs are like really starting to grow out. And so like I don't really know what to do with them. I kind of want to, I miss flipping my hair to the side. I haven't been able to do that <laughs> since I cut my hair because I have my little bangage going on. <laughs> All right, just add a little bit more, and then how are you doing? It's I'm almost done. I just I just got one last scoop. I'm gonna put water to dilute it, and yeah, my it is just such a good product. Yeah. It is so moisturizing. It's so thick. It's just I'm so glad we figured out how to work this. Yeah, you did that. You did yeah. That. I really do. I like that. You know, it's like we're all on this journey together. And anyone watching the video that's ever tried it and it didn't work, like maybe today the light bulb will go off and you'll be like, yeah. oh my god!" Or any other products you have that are yeah. just like, this is way too thick. Like, you can control, you know, how thick it is. Thin it out. <laughs> yeah. And I guess and you can be personal about how you thin it out. Maybe somebody would want to thin it out with the leave-in. I would think it would be a little costly with that. Cause that leave-in, I'm going the leave-in kind of goes quickly when yeah. you spray it. It kind of goes. Yeah. All right. So my product is in. My product's in too. Oh my gosh! Look at your shirt. Yeah. What is your shirt? Oh, I thought no. it was wet. No, it's not. <laughs> okay. So our product is in. We are going to air dry our hair around the house because it is snowing outside. Mm -hmm. um, air dry our hair around the house while I sit in front of some fans or something. Um, then. Um, diffuse I might diffuse a little bit uh, but we will be back to show you these bomb dryer results yep okay. anything else we're good nope, that'll be it all right okay. see you guys soon bye, bye bye and we are back these are our results using the Talia Wahid green apple aloe with coconut lime oh you picked up yours too okay yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ching. so our curls are Defined, mm -hmm. very defined. I feel very. like you got a better wash and go than I did. I mean, I love my wash and go, but I just feel like, like I was telling my mom that we try so much stuff, and sometimes like I'll take to a line more than she does, or mm -hmm. I love my results more than she does, or vice versa. And we could tell and, when we take to a line because yeah. then we like own it. Like meaning, like we live in the same house, we're really within walking distance of each other's rooms. But like when we really like something, we want to just put it in our room on yeah. our shelves. So Talia Wahid, I own. I like. Yeah, you line. tested yeah. it first. You mm -hmm. really broke it down. Yeah. You really figured out how to use it. Yeah. So and then on my days off, you I love still this use line. it. So when I use things on my days off of filming, then I know I like it. Yeah. So, and like um, your wash and go looks really good. Your curls mm -hmm. are really defined and like pretty over here. 
Calm down, Very girl. soft, yeah. <laughs> and that was definitely because of, like, you realizing that the product was too thick, so, like, you figured out yeah. how to get it to work for your hair by diluting it um, with yes. water, it's, and it looks really, really it's good. It's really moisturized. Yeah, it's very defined, very moisturized. It's just really... It, I own it. It's like yeah, I'm not saying I don't love mine. Like yes. I like mine too. It came out nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, big, very big, big. very big. Good. Yeah, no, it's we big. look good. It looks yeah, good. No, it's cute. <laughs> I really, I really like. It's like right. It's, I feel as passionate about this line as I did about the cream of nature. Yeah. Um, some and lines just stand out. And you yes. just get a good wash and go. Exactly. And this is definitely one of them. It's consistent, clearly, because mm -hmm. you keep using it. You keep getting the like. I think this is the bombest you've gotten though for some yeah. reason. This looks really good. I didn't rush it. Um, yeah, I not just, at all. Yeah. I took a nap. I can't believe my makeup is still intact. I, like, I crashed on. out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> In front of the fan. And yeah. when I woke up, my hair was dry. Yeah. It, it didn't take long. Yeah. We no. had that that heater on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So these are our results. Um, I was looking online to see where you can get these products at so far it just looks like it's on their website i believe it's like called naturalhair.org i'll put it in the description box um every single one of these products are 9.99 oh. i believe sometimes they have like um uh, you can get all three for a deal or something like that i don't know no. but um that's so far that's where they're at i don't know where they or else they might be sold but so far you can get them online we'll put that link down below if you are interested um anything else you want to say nope just make it your own. Just yeah. Try it. Yeah. Don't be the takeaway message from this yeah. video. Just make it your own. Make all products your own. But this one, you kind of we we got it at this point, and so we're delivering that message from this moment forward that we just have to make these products our own. Mm -hmm. So um, this is all part of reviewing it, testing, and trying. So I'm glad we didn't give up on it. Think it was yeah. too thick for our hair because we love it. I still think though that. Um, all the dilution in the world like it probably won't work for like wavy type hair i mean it, i think it's probably a little bit too right. thick for that at least the um the curl definer but you have like type three type four hair type three you probably gonna want to dilute it mm -hmm. type four maybe not so much um but yeah i think it's a pretty solid line across the board yeah for the natural hair world mm -hmm. you mean just this one the apple yeah the just apple the apple aloe right okay. now yeah all right Alrighty. Yeah. Alright. So, thank you so much for watching this video. And we'll see you in our next video. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>